Hey everyone, Leo Bond here. I'm back again today for the Best Buy Canada plug-in blog, and this time it's with a quick look at the Jimu Robot Builder Bots Kit from UB Tech, which is a robotic build set that you assemble yourself into one of two different official modes, or you can come up with something entirely original yourself. And the official modes are basically construction vehicles. One is called Grabber Bot. That one kind of resembles an excavator or a digger. It's the one with the long arm and the claw at the end. And the other, which ironically is called Digbot, looks more like a bulldozer or some sort of plow. And that's the one that I built for my test. So we're going to talk a little bit about that build. And I'll show the end result in action. And I'll also give you a quick look at the Jimu app, as well as discuss some of the things that you can do with that. So let's get right into it. Okay, first things first. What all comes with this set? So inside the most organized product box that I probably have ever seen, you're going to get four servos, one infrared sensor, one LED light, one lithium-ion battery, one charging adapter that plugs into any standard wall outlet, a whole bunch of different snap together parts including four different kinds of connector pegs and one main control box so basically the brain of this thing and that will talk to your smart device through a bluetooth connection in conjunction with the freely downloadable Jimu app and that app of course is compatible with both Android and iOS based smartphones and tablets and I'm not exactly privy to the minimum device requirements to work with this set so you might want to do a little bit of digging to find that out and make sure that your phone is worthy. Now, as for the build process itself, well, assembling this robot was pretty freaking fast. Way faster than what I expected for a set with over 350 total pieces. It only took me about two hours in all, and that is with trying to film and photograph some parts of the process, and also while listening to a hockey game on my phone, which is the same phone that I was filming with, as well as looking at the build instructions on. Because one of the things that's interesting about this particular kit is that it doesn't come with any paper for instructions. They're entirely app-based, and I was extremely skeptical about this when I first opened the set and realized that that was the case. I thought for sure that I wouldn't be able to see the diagrams of the various steps on my very small smartphone screen, and that it would make the build process really difficult to complete. But, I could not have been more wrong about that. The detail given and the fact that every single step has its own very clear 3D animation that you can manipulate to view from different angles makes it extremely easy to comprehend every aspect of the build from what components you need for a given step to what you need to do with those components and ultimately to how it all comes together. And there's even a progress bar that lets you see exactly where you are in the build process at any given time. So very cool and very well done instructions. Of course, there are no tools required to complete this set. All of the connections are made through those color-coded pegs, and it's always very clear from the instructions which color peg you need to use, too, with different colors representing different peg sizes or types. So you almost can't even make a mistake with this thing. It's very straightforward, and honestly, completing the build itself was my favorite thing about having this Jimu set around. Now, once your bot is built, you can start playing with him and controlling him via the Jimu app. And I think that my favorite part of this was just basically driving it around and making it lift and lower its scoop and turn its little LED that's mounted on the top and that sort of thing. Uh, that little LED almost kind of looks like an eye looking at you, so it's very, very cool. And the DigBot drives around very well on its tank treads, and it's really quite a lot of fun to control. But you can also do different things within the app, such as access the actions feature, where you make your bot perform all kinds of interesting actions and make weird noises and stuff or you can do educational activities with the app, such as starting up the coding feature and doing blocky coding to program your bot to do basically whatever you want him to do. And there's even a Jimu community that you can plug into and share your own unique builds or see other people's interesting designs, although you do have to make an account to use this feature. But it is very cool that you can communicate with other Jimu enthusiasts and share with and learn from each other. Of course, Jimu does have its own whole backstory, and there are various other sets that you can pick up with their own special characters that you can build. So it really is something bigger than just this one particular set, and I think that that's actually a pretty cool thing. So yeah, overall, I did like the Jimu Robot BuilderBots kit well enough and I would recommend it for the right type of user. 
someone with an interest in build toys or engineering, or someone that tends to gravitate towards toys that promote learning in the STEM fields, because that is exactly what this set, and indeed the entire Jimu series, is all about. For those that aren't really into that sort of thing though, it's probably not such a good fit. Anyway, that's all I'm going to say about the Jimu BuilderBots kit for now, though I would encourage you to investigate further and learn more about the overall Jimu series if you're thinking of picking one of these sets up, because there's definitely a whole lot more to them than what I can possibly lay out here. In any case, I do hope that this has been helpful, and if you enjoyed the video or found it useful, please give it a like or a share, and subscribe as well if you'd like to see more toy and tech gadget reviews. For now though, I'd just like to thank you all for watching, Hope to see you back here again for the next video. Have an excellent day, and I'll see you soon.